Hello friends, in this video, let us see how to install Lineage OS 13.0 on the MIPad. First, you have to download the Lineage OS 13.0 ROM and you have to you have to install the TWRP recovery. The ROM the ROM is stable so you can even install Google Apps for it. I have installed them. Here it is Lineage 13.0 unofficial mocha and and here are the open gaps ARM 6.0 pico and you, for rooting it Lineage OS doesn't have the root in settings so we have to install super so I will give all the links in the description and you have to also download this LOS 13 mount.img it is a boot dot image after installing it you can access the SD card and USB drives so we have to install it ok now reboot into the recovery now select power button and the volume of button at the same time For installing TWRP recovery, you can watch my old videos to, to install this. Now wipe, select advanced wipe, dial with cache, cache, system and data. Now swipe. Now select back and select install and select the storage where you have downloaded the ROM. I have downloaded it here. Linux 13.0 now swipe The ROM has installed. Now select wipe catch here and dial it. After swiping it, for installing gaps, it has limited system space, so we can't install gaps like this. For that, we should reboot our recovery. And now we have to select wipe, advanced wipe and select system and select repair or change file system. Now select resize file system and now swipe. Now select back. Now you can install the gaps, Google Apps. Select where you have installed your gaps. Open gaps arm 6.0 pico. Now select wipe, cache or dalvik and select back and now select install image. You should select this where you have kept your image file and now select lost 13 mount.img. You have to select boot because it is boot.image. Now swipe. It has completed. Now you have to now if you want to root you have to in install this super soup now swipe
they have said that first reboot, first reboot may take a few minutes it can also loop a few times do not interrupt the process select wipe cache or dalvik and now select reboot system as they have said that it may re reboots for some time we have to not interrupt the process it will auto automatically reboot taking some time they have said that it will loop so it is not it is not due to the mistake of the rom but it is due to the root but nothing will happen to it Okay, the ROM is starting now. Okay, the ROM has started. Select next. Now select your time zone. I will set up this later. Select next. Skip next and start this rom is stable and uh, it has only one bug that the microphone is not working and it will be fixed soon later if you want to check the camera is working fine and music so the sound is also working fine and there is only one bug that is the microphone this rom is stable and you can use it for day as daily driver ok guys thanks for watching i hope you like this video and don't forget to subscribe Thank you.